Hello and good day, welcome to our YouTube channel, God's Promises. And today's video will be Book of Philippians Chapter 4. Let's get started now. The Book of Philippians Chapter 4 is a powerful message of encouragement and exhortation for Christians to remain steadfast in their faith, even in the face of trials and hardships. This chapter contains several well-known verses that have become sources of inspiration and hope for believers throughout the centuries. Paul begins this chapter by urging the Philippians to stand firm in the Lord and to rejoice in Him always. He emphasizes that our joy should not be dependent on our circumstances, but rather on our relationship with Christ. This is an important lesson for us today, as we too often allow the ups and downs of life to dictate our emotions and attitudes. Paul then goes on to encourage the Philippians to be gentle and considerate in their dealings with others, and to bring their requests to God through prayer and supplication. He reminds them that the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard their hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. The lesson from this passage is that we should be quick to show kindness and compassion to others, and to seek God's peace through prayer and trust in Him. We should not allow anxiety or worry to consume us, but rather bring our concerns to God and trust in His faithfulness. Paul also emphasizes the importance of thinking on things that are true, noble, just, pure, lovely, and of good report. He encourages the Philippians to focus on these things, rather than on negative or destructive thoughts. The lesson from this passage is that our thought life has a powerful impact on our attitudes and actions. We should strive to think positively and to focus on things that are uplifting and edifying, rather than on negative or harmful thoughts. Paul then goes on to express his gratitude to the Philippians for their support and partnership in the gospel. He tells them that he has learned to be content in all circumstances, whether he is well-fed or hungry, whether he is living in plenty or in want. He emphasizes that he can do all things through Christ who strengthens him. The lesson from this passage is that contentment does not come from our circumstances, but rather from our relationship with Christ. We should strive to be content in all circumstances, trusting in God's provision and strength to sustain us. Finally, Paul reminds the Philippians that their God will supply all their needs according to His riches and glory in Christ Jesus. He encourages them to give generously and to trust in God's faithfulness to meet their needs. The lesson from this passage is that we should trust in God's provision and give generously as an act of worship and obedience. We should not be consumed by worry or fear, but rather place our trust in God's abundant provision and grace. In conclusion, the book of Philippians chapter 4 is a powerful reminder to Christians to remain steadfast in their faith, to focus on the things that are true, noble, and of good report, and to trust in God's provision and faithfulness. We should seek to be content in all circumstances and to give generously as an act of worship and obedience. May we be encouraged by these timeless truths and live our lives in a manner worthy of the gospel of Christ. Thank you for visiting us today. Please share with us your favorite Bible chapter below in the comments section. Don't forget to like and subscribe, it really does help our channel grow. Looking forward to see you back here for our next video. Always take good care.